Liquid nitrogen fountain. Good for a cold shower in the morning. And now this is there. It's frozen now. Pink, pink, wait, actually. <laughs> Anything else you want to freeze? If you got, um, you know, paints. <laughs> <laughs> Once it thaws out. <laughs> now, um, this has practically, I mean, you, you can use this to remove warts, you can freeze warts. And uh, you can even freeze people, uh, cryogenically frozen people. Um, it's, uh, you know, if you're really rich and you want to have a chance to come back to life at some future time when. We have the right technology, maybe to do it. Uh, it's you know, of, you know, certain billionaires have frozen their bodies in liquid nitrogen, um, but it's pretty expensive, you know, because you got to keep refilling the liquid nitrogen in the tank. Actually, the center part is a bit soft still. <laughs> but basically, you can turn a, you can turn a banana into a hammer. But so you can defeat a nail. Uh, you could drive a nail into. A banana, even a piece of wood with banana. This, even the thermos here, it's getting pretty cold to the outside. I can still hold it. You can actually think about it. It has to be pretty good thermos because what's inside is minus 196 degrees and I can still hold it to, with my hand. Nice cold uh, uh, out of here. Let me do one more thing. You can make artificial clouds. Ooh, this is getting cold. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'll make a small artificial cloud here. Because, well, when you see the, this not really, you're not seeing smoke. When you're seeing uh, the mist, you see, is basically uh, uh, moisture in the air that's condensing, okay? Because of the cold uh, of the liquid nitrogen. Uh, the low temperature is causing moisture in there to condense. It's basically like forming a cloud. See, I'm forming a cloud here.
just going to put this back so I still have some for later. Alright. So if you, if you want to see more of this, uh, uh, come to the magic show at 12.30 or 3 o'clock tomorrow. <laughs> Doing the open house. <laughs> <laughs> it's always fun to play with cryogenic fluids. <laughs> I, I do it often, I never get bored of it. 